Hi, Widgie Bushcraft here. This is a, uh, a video response to Johnny Bushcraft. It's a subscribers competition. Hi Johnny, hope you're okay. Um, his question or his uh, request was for us to teach him something. Um, I'm hoping just to show you something that one simple or a set of simple instructions to uh, to maybe save a life. So, um, firstly, I need a volunteer, and getting a volunteer has been very very hard for this. So, um, if you don't mind, I'll introduce you to a friend. Help me, Johnny! Help me, Johnny! Don't let him loose on me. This is my caravan club teddy bear, as featured in a previous video. Help me! Help me! Obviously he's, um, he's all for it, so um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to get him ready and um, show, you what to, show you what I'm about to teach you, hopefully. You probably, uh, you know, something that prob probably everybody knows or everybody should know, but uh, I'll take you through it anyway. Help me! Help me! <laughs> See you shortly. So, I brought you back. Here's Mr Caravan Club Teddy. I've come across him. He's not moving. Um, he's been laid in his basher. I've come across and um, it doesn't look right. So, what we first do, because we're concerned, we need to go up to him, minding, you know, taking care that um, there's no dangers for ourselves. You know, no fallen objects, no electricity. Um, if he's in a house, no carbon monoxide. You know, anything like that. Any uh, hidden dangers that can harm yourself and then you're uh, uh, no good to anybody. You can't help nobody. You certainly can't help Mr Caravan Club Teddy. So we go up to the chap, the poor little chap, and we shake. Hello Caravan Club Teddy, can you hear me? Can you open your eyes? I can't see any response. So firstly, I'm just going to check in his little mouth, just to make sure he's, there's no choke hazards, there's no vomit, no, uh, no blood, uh, no fallen false teeth. I can't see that, his mouth looks nice and clear. So, I'm just going to tilt his head, head back. That is the most simplest way you can save somebody's life. This is this tiny little, tiny little action that saves somebody's life. He hand on the forehead, two fingers under the chin, tilt the head back. And all that does is straighten up the airway and open it up. That in itself is a lifesaver. So that is really what I wanted to teach you. But um, from here, we check for breathing. Now we need to check for breathing for 10 seconds. And what I'm gonna do is listen for 10 seconds, place my hand on his chest to feel any rise or fall. So after 10 seconds has passed, I can tell that he's breathing, he's unconscious. And while I'm checking for breathing, I'm just seeing if there's no major hemorrhaging, no major bleeding. Can't see any major bleeding. So if there's help available, he's breathing, I need to ask a bystander or somebody else to uh, call an ambulance. I've got an unconscious caravan club teddy bear who is breathing, with no, breathing unresponsive with no serious hemorrhaging cuts or anything like that. And also, you must ask them to come back to you and report that they've done that. You don't want them just to, uh, to wander off and you don't know whether they've called the ambulance or not. So that's really it. So, recap. Danger. Check for dangers before you go to the casualty. You don't want to harm yourself uh, trying to help somebody because you'll be no good to, uh, to him or yourself. Check response. Shake. Just gently shake shout and sometimes you can pinch in here just touch the uh, touch the eyelids for any response 
no response. Check the airway is clear, airway is clear, tilt the head back, that simple little thing saves a life. The airway is open, check for breathing for 10 seconds, and uh, while you're doing that, check for colour of the patient, any bleeding, any visible signs of injury, and call for an ambulance. That's if the, if the patient or the caravan club teddy is conscious, uh, unconscious, sorry. I'm not going to go into CPR or, um, or anything like that, cardiac arrest. That's just one simple manoeuvre. Unconscious patients, it's the same in children, same in adults. Tilt the head back. Easy as that. Can save a life. Hope that's uh, taught you a little something. If you know it already, I'm not trying to teach you to, uh, to suck eggs. So, I hope that helps. And um, I hope that qualifies for, a, uh, for an entry. Thanks for watching, and um, I'll catch you on the next one. It's Widgie Bushcraft signing out.